Good to see you again, Scratch Ticket fans. Your true Idaho, Idaho Scratcher with TIT Productions. And you're not seeing an optical illusion. It is ticket 191 to 184, which means it's more than five tickets, but we are doing Climb the Ladder. Yeah, we are. How did that happen? Well, I will show you. Well, I finally found a ticket that uh, has higher odds than our best odds. They still actually accept these for the new and improved. I don't know why, but they improved. The new and improved, I think it's the prize because they used to only give a thousand bucks. Now it's 4,000. People are going to chase that right there. So they're going to try a new way of doing it. Not necessarily odds, but they're going to actually put bigger prizes there. So that's how they're going to change here. But the, here, the caveat here is that I have been always telling you that you always chase the odds. And since we had really good odds, like one in two, two, five on the My Lucky Day, and I only had five tickets, I get these massive numbers of wins and stuff. I'd pull through, you know, five, and I'd have like three winners, sometimes four winners. Or sometimes all five would win, just rarely, but it would do it. And sometimes I'd only get one winner. Well, on the Double Doubler, this one has odds. Let me show you on it right now. Right there. One in four, three, seven. Those are some killer odds. Those kill everything. Now it's actually one in four, three, seven for overall, but it's one in eight actually to get a dollar. So I got eight tickets and I've been harping all the time saying, Chase, make sure you follow those odds because I don't want you to see the wipeout. What do I mean by the wipeout? Well, what ends up happening is that you uh, you get like five tickets and you don't get anything. That's the wipeout. You get $5 for $5. That is kind of crap. You actually at least get $1. You know, I always say showing you how to get, you know, more than lottery than what you pay for lottery for free or, you know, profit on your lottery. That's what I always say. Let them pay you to play the lottery. So here we go. We are going to do the double doubler ticker ticket. There's a single prize, a double prize and a double doubler, which is actually a four X I imagine, but it's going to sit right here and you will see it. They actually write it down there. It's weird. I thought it would be like, you know, one X as an like two X and then it would be like four X, but no, it's actually double doubler. I guess is what it says right there. So let's see if we find that. What does it do? What are we doing here? What are we doing? We are going to match three like amounts and you win the prize. That's all I get. Uh, if you get one, get a chance to do the win the double or the four times the prize, a double doubler. So you do that right there. So you don't need any symbol. You just need three types and then scratch that. All right. I already showed you the odds on this one in four, three, seven, which is terrible. But here's also something that's funny. There is a sixteen dollar winner in every pack. Woohoo! No more tens. No more fours. No more eight dollar winners. Only in three hundred tickets. No. Now you can find sixteen dollars in three hundred tickets. Hmm. I don't know if I'm going to find it with this, but now that I'm pulling eight of them, there might be a better chance to do that. So let's start. <laughs> oh, yes. I remember when I had the four odds, the one in four, six, four stuff with the taco about money and stuff like that. Woo, that one gave us a big hit. Of course, now you notice that we do not get a dollar all the time when we see a dollar. You have to be careful about that. But we can get better prizes now. More diversity of prizes, not just ones and two dollars. That is what this higher odds do, but they can still kill you. <laughs> but they did not do it there. So I didn't have to pull eight tickets to get one winner. I just had to pull one. But do you notice something? What is that? What is that? F O. I know what this is. This is a four dollar winner. And you want to know why? Because that's going to be a double doubler. We just got a double doubler. Wow, I'm trying to show you the, uh, that if I just play the odds, I get it, and I win it on one ticket. I could have bought five tickets and had this, but now I pulled eight. Now I'm like, hopefully I get more. <laughs> well, okay, okay, let's see what it is. And it's a double doubler ticket. There it is, four times your prize. Wow, four bucks. Well, I didn't even have to pull five, uh, eight of them. I could have just went ahead and pulled five like I normally do. And you can but I was just trying to illustrate a point. That's all I was doing. Cause we only had $1 last time. I mean, last time we had $1 and I had like a uh, $6 lottery for four bucks. That's what it was on this last ticket. And I did say I was going to do this and try it with the eight of them. And all I had to do was pull one. Go figure. Uh, I always try to do that, but you just have that chance of, you know, wiping out. And uh, maybe I should have done that when I wiped out instead of doing this, but you know, it just seemed like it was a good idea. F zero. Oh, uh, actually it's not a zero. That's actually no now. They actually spent the extra money to make a little row. <laughs> all righty. How many more are we going to get? Are all of them, or all of them going to lose? Like seven in a row, <laughs> whatever. I don't, I have no idea. I can probably get six in a row that can lose with, with the odds of one, four, three, seven. You can actually get about six of them in a row that lose. All righty. Here we go. Ticket number 190. Let's see if we can't find some more. I don't mind that. Man, I'll be glad to, you know, 
Oh, back to back winners, I think. That's an O N E. I'm I'm pretty sure. Okay, now this ticket is just making fun of me. It's just laughing at me. I'm telling you, back-to-back -back winners, even with the terrible odds. Okay, I get it. <laughs> I, I have to tell you, I know why it does it. It's pretty easy. I mean, you got a bag of marbles. You got 300 of them, 300 in a pack, and you've got, like, you know, a certain number of them, one in four, three, seven, whatever, for winners. And so you put a certain number of them, probably 200 and, uh, God, 60 or something, and then, like, 40 or something of winners inside there and you reach in there and you grab multiple winners that's just what happens you grab multiple red marbles there is an one that means there is no reason to do this it says single prize so one times prize there it is all right well back to back five bucks you know what i could have pulled two tickets just two tickets on climb the ladder and i would have had double the lottery that i was paid for well whatever <laughs> there it is now okay now this is getting ridiculous i now have six tickets left and i gotta get at least one more winner oh man that's one reason why I only pull five, because you never know what you're going to get. Maybe you can get a $16 winner pulling five tickets. And if you do this enough times, you're going to see it. Ticket number 189. Back to back to back. Let's do it. I'm tired of the, you know, pulling all the losers. Let's pull all the winners this time. I don't have to do it that way, but oh my God. Now I'm just pulling nothing but winners. Back to back to back. What the heck? Uh, it still has good odds, even at one in four. I don't know. Maybe it's just tricking me. I try to make a point, and I don't even get a chance to do that. Why? Because the lottery likes to pull my chain. But you get the idea. I just got just a ton of winners. I mean, just this is just what happens sometimes. There is another dollar right there. Hmm. Now we have six bucks. Okay. Okay, now you're just getting, you know, really funny. Now, Mr. Lottery Double Dollar, I love you. Yeah, I love you. You're doing it. I love getting the money. It's always good. We now have $6 on lottery. I just have nothing but three tickets in a row. That is so cool. I still like it. Now we'll get a loser, I'm pretty sure. 188. Not looking for losers, but I like... We can have this whole stack and be winners for all I care. But <laughs> one thing is, is, I was trying to prove a point that I pull eight of them. Because it's one in eight to win a dollar. And I've actually won two dollars back to back. So, pff, <laughs> screw the odds, I guess, is what they say. Just play. But I want to make sure that you can get a consistency with Climb the Ladder. That's one reason why I'm doing this. Just show you. And there's that sea sting of death. Okay. Now there's the finger. I get it. Alrighty. It all works out in the end. I know. There we go. There's a loser. My God. <laughs> well, we got the losing out of the way. Let's get another winner. <laughs> I'm okay for that. I still got like four tickets. All right, we got 187, this one, and three more. So let's see if we can't get some more. Six dollars a lottery already. And I pulled eight of these. Sometimes I wonder why I even listen to myself. <laughs> I mean, it's just the way it is. I mean, you're going to get what you're going to get. You just pull enough of them to win something. There's next team. Mm-hmm. FX something. I have no idea, but there's two in a row. And then look at that. You have a dollar right there, but it doesn't necessarily mean you win. It's okay. I guess that's okay with that. Remember, I had four losers in a row before I got that dollar on the last time I did this. Trying to show a story and what happens. Oh, that looks familiar. Oh, yeah, that looks very familiar. Oh, man. Well, I guess I did, did show you something. Pull eight, and you actually get eight bucks back. I still got the double. What can I say? Oh, that's so cool. Let's see. Well, two times the prize would be four, but I got a W there. Four times the prize would be eight bucks, and that's EGT, and that doesn't work there, so single. Hmm. That works for me. There's eight bucks. What the heck? Uh, screw the odds, they say. They don't mean anything. <laughs> I don't know about that. You just got to know that you got to pull enough of them to be able to give yourself a chance. Climb the ladder. We're going to get eight, eight extra dollars. Or we're, we're at like, like $16 a lottery for eight bucks. That's like, you know, 200%. <laughs> uh, if it was just 100%, I'd be, you know, like eight and eight. But it's actually 200% because I'm playing $16 a lottery for eight bucks. Let's do it. Let's see what happens here. 
A 200% showing for a 100% buy. Okay. There's that other X sting of death. Sometimes, unless you're spelling six, and that's not there, so we got a loser. That's not too bad. I'm getting pretty good with that. I got like, like half the tickets are winners and half the tickets are losers. That can happen. That's like a one in two, not a one in four, three, seven. So we just pulled a good patch. What can I say? I could have pulled five tickets and still had that six, you know, six dollars right there. Now I have eight. Let's see that 32. Give it to me. I dare you. I double dare you. Oh my goodness. Ah, I got 10 bucks. <laughs> okay, this ticket's just being funny. Nuh-uh. Don't trick me on that. That's not a C, that's a TWO. Yes, it is. And there's $2 right there. I'm seeing things. I'm looking through the camera too, and I saw that little thing on it. There was a scratch dust on there. I thought it was going to be something else. Cackles went up my neck. Well, $10. And what happened? Five tickets won and three lost. What can I say? Uh, you know, you also got to realize more tickets, more wins. I, I don't mind doing um, Climb the Ladder with eight. It's not a really big deal. Um, some of you, have, like, like in California, Florida, New York, those you guys uh, have some high odd tickets. I mean, I'm telling you, they're really high. I've seen them on your websites and stuff like that. They're really bad. You're 1 in 12, I think, in New York for a dollar ticket. That's ridiculous. I mean, crazy. That's what I saw. It was a while ago, probably in February when I checked in something like that. But, yeah, it was pretty bad. Anyways, we got five winners and only three losers. I, I don't get it. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I, I'm getting $10 a lottery to go and play with. And that's great. But I was just trying to show you how that when if you see odds like when it, pack odds that say one in a, you know one in eight to get a dollar, you may want to get about eight of them when you're playing climb the ladder because if you get eight of them that way, you have the chance of getting this. There's the five winners. There's the three losers. It could have easily been three uh, winners and five losers, and it can get that ugly. Sometimes you may have only two and six losers. Remember, you can have six in a row that can lose on this. So. Leave yourself some leeway, and that's what this climbing ladder was all about. This was actually just a little lesson that I wanted to show, even though we get to climb even further, which is awesome because we have ourselves $10. What am I going to do? A $10 ticket. Oh, ho, 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 ho. man, that's like $18 worth of lottery worth <laughs> for eight bucks. Well, that's actually pretty good. So what am I going to do? There's so many options, so many options. going to be hard to figure it out, but I think I can do it. I will be right back. And we are back. What did I go and do? Well, I went and did what I was supposed to do. Go as high up the lottery as I could go. And I got a $10 limited ticket. This one has a boomer ticket. You get $50 or $100. It's very rare to do it. But if we do it, oh, man, the excitement could be off the chain. <laughs> to speak. So to speak, I should say. Anyways, we got the $10 limited. We have now $18 of lottery for it. $8 because I did the double doubler. I have been doing that test. So much for a test, right? <laughs> now we are doing this one, the 10th edition. Look how beautiful this ticket is, but it is mean underneath. One in nine for a $50 or $100 cash prize. Ticket number 10. And the odds on this ticket are actually, it's weird. I don't get it, but it's 859 right there, but it says one in nine on the front, so I don't know. Anyways, it's actually like one, in, then you get like one in 11 to actually win anything. So looking for a stack of money, 50 or hundred dollars, top prizes. I don't know why a lot of people like this game. People don't may not understand that, hey, all you can get is 50 or hundred. So if you're drawing like 20 of these and you let like 50 bucks, you are losing money. Ugh, crazy. Reveal a stack of money and that's what we're going to look for. Oh my God, what am I doing? <laughs> oh man. Uh, now I feel like regret or whatever. I could have gotten a $5 ticket, a $3 ticket, a $2 ticket and played it that way. More tickets, more wins, more chances to win. Instead, I just went all out and go to a $10 ticket. Sometimes this happens. Sometimes the person in you is cap that makes the decisions, the all-fetching <laughs> decisions can make you go astray. Will it do that today? 
I don't know, but I'm definitely going to find out like right now. <sighs> oh man, if we do find a stack of money, oh, the craziness, the craziness. It could be every time I do this, I am always like hopeful. I need to find a stack of money. <sighs> I'm hopeful, but you know what reality is. Reality is always the truth. <laughs> oh, three more rows. And with that, my nerves just keep getting worse and worse. Ugh, I would, I want climb the ladder to get this boost right here. It's such a boost. You pay eight bucks. I'm actually saving $2 on this ticket anyways. I got $8 right there. <laughs> and we won 10. Oh, geez. What am I doing to myself? Driving myself insane. Pot of gold does not win. A gold bar doesn't win. What wins? A heart doesn't win. A frog definitely doesn't win. Gold nugget doesn't win either. Oh, so many money, different items. A gem, a diamond up there. Gold bar, pot of gold, a gold nugget. They all don't win. Yikes. What did I get myself into? I got myself into the you-know-what. Boy, he doesn't like to scratch. Another heart. There's probably a reason for that. Another pot of gold. A cherry. That's a consolation prize. Fire. The sun. Last line. Last hope. And with it, this last line quickly fades. Ugh. Well, sometimes I got to take that risk. And I know one of these days that I take this risk, I'm finally going to get paid out. It will happen. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but sometime. Because if it ever does, it's huge. And today is the same as many of those other times I've done this. <laughs> we didn't find that stack of cash. I have found it before on this, and I found it twice. <laughs> oh, one of the on these limited tickets, I found it twice. We had two $50 winners on back-to-back. -back. This time, not happening. So what did we just do? Climb the ladder ends with $18 of a lottery for $8. I played the odds on this, and it wound up the uh, the double doubler has a high odds. It's one in four three seven, and of overall pack odds though it's one in eight to actually win a dollar. So I got eight of them, and we wound up getting ten dollars. We got ten times the amount they stated for having eight tickets, which is actually pretty good. And then I ran off and played the limited edi tenth edition, looking for that big win, and of course I didn't find it. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Let me know what you like and what you don't. Hey, we do this kind of stuff all the time. Climb the ladder is adjustable. You are capable of playing it any way you'd like to. Remember to play the odds. Seems like we did pretty good. $18 a lottery for eight bucks. That's not bad. That's more than double. More than double right there. Hmm. Can't ask for anything more than that, except for asking that this would have won. That's all I could ask for. <laughs> Anyways, we like to try to show you how to play the lottery for less money. $18 for eight or actually play it for free. Sometimes you can actually erase this original starting cost and play everything on there for free or get paid to play. I could have taken $8 on this, made it all free, played a $2 ticket, and it would have all been free. It's all about perspective. You guys take care now, and I will see you again. Bye-bye.